All right, ladies at home, stand up and listen to this because we've got lots of energy in the studio, I should say first. This is motivational speaker and international best-selling author, Patty Alfonso, who is here to talk to us about why loving our body is so important. And it goes way beyond just the physical aspects, but we're going to talk a little bit about why it's important mentally, too. So tell people, don't, why is that important? You know, everything that we have in this world is actually for our bodies. If you didn't have a body, you wouldn't need clothes, you wouldn't need food. So including your body in your life is the best way to start really loving and enjoying your life. And isn't that what life is all about? Absolutely, about living in the moment, for sure. So we have five mistakes that we yes. should avoid in order to love our body. Yes. We'll start with this. The first mistake to avoid if you want to love your body is forcing yourself to work out. Look, if you don't like going to the gym and you don't like doing dumbbells, then I say don't do it. Find other ways to move your body. The second mistake to avoid if you want to love your body is forcing yourself to eat salad. <laughs> if you don't like eating like a rabbit, don't do it. There are other ways to juice your veggies. The second mistake, the next mistake to avoid if you want to love your body is forcing yourself to wear uncomfortable things. <laughs> Look, Spanx has made a fortune making women feel uncomfortable in their body. So if you want to love your body, wear things that make you feel good. The next mistake to avoid if you want to love your body is buying cheap things. Oh. What color should the bottom of this shoe be? I don't know. Red! Oh. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> the Louboutin? <laughs> yes! Our bodies are actually made for luxury and if you're buying cheap things then that may be one reason why you don't love your body. Well, I definitely like that we are doing away with the Spanx. Yes. I'd really like to just do away with high heels all together. Let's do but, it. But, okay, cool. <laughs> So those are some of the things that we need to avoid. Yes. Now let's talk about what we want to bring into our life. Yes. The first thing to love your body is B. Break old patterns. And we're going to do this together. You okay. ready? I'm ready. It's a shaking exercise. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. shake you want shake, to shake, shake your shake. whole body. Move your shoulders. Move shake, your shake. bum. Shake, shake, move shake. your belly. And this shaking exercise actually <laughs> induces the parasympathetic nerve response system. I feel good. Which really just means, <laughs> yeah, it relaxes your body. And when you're relaxed and your body is relaxed, you can release tension. You get a lot happier and a lot more mm. joyful. O is for open your senses. Mmm, the best way to do this is with your favorite perfume. Nice. Check it out. Oh, that puts my <gasps> Victoria's Secret <gasps> body spray to shame. Ooh, Chanel number <laughs> five, girl, speaking Very of nice. luxury. Okay, <laughs> so when you open your senses, it actually opens up your whole body, and you really want to open all of your senses your sight, your smell, your touch, your taste, and your hearing. Love it. D. Do something fun! <laughs> to-do list? Absolutely. Of course. You have always. to. Always. First thing I did do today, my shaking exercise in the morning. That's why I have so much energy. <laughs> we need you every morning. I yes, know. let's do it. I'm ready. I, I, know. We guys, I wish we had more time for sure. We're going to take this out of the break. You guys want to turn on your bubble machine? Yes. And with that being said, you can get uh, find out more there about you. Patty's there tips about loving your body and living in the moment. We've posted more information on our website at vrproud.com as well as a link to her international best-selling book, Your Body as Consciousness? Your Body as the Creation of Consciousness! There you have it.